Hello, welcome, and thanks for joining us live on Projan Media TV, wherever you are and where you're tuning in from. We are very grateful that kindly consider subscribing and turning on the notification button for more of these updates. National Unit Platform's Moses Vigira warns His Excellency Welka Gutam 7 that he managed to take away his wife, but this time round, he will not steal his small house. Once again, thanks for joining us live on Progen Media TV. But let's take a quick look into some of these details. The renowned National Unit Platform member Moses Vigira has accused President Yoweri Museven of conniving with a state house operative to take his wife away from him. In one of his Facebook posts on Thursday, Bigirwa, a former Kamuli municipality parliamentary contestant, said that a state house operative identified as Hamza last year took his wife, a one Kagoya, to Museven, where President gave her a life threatening mission to accomplish. The opposition politician claims Museven gave Kagoya huge sums of money to finish a mission against him. Therefore, he talked about his marital life where he said he married his wife in 2013. They have two beautiful children. But last year in March, she got a test house operative, Musinguze, known as Hamza, who took her to meet President Museven in State House. And she came back home in Gangu Busawala with a huge amount of money to complete a mission. Bigira said that they disagreed the following day and President Museven called her at 6 a.m. as he was making a follow-up on the mission he gave her to accomplish. By the time of the call, Bigira was still in bed and woke up, asked her wife what's going on, then she replied that it's her affairs with the president. Therefore, Bigira, Bigira took off because of fear and rushed to Kamuli municipality uh, for fear of anything like poison. So he decided to leave the wife and remain with children, but he kept on sending the necessities of the family. Though Bigira ran away out of the fear, left his home, marital home, and rushed to Kamuli municipality due to the fears of maybe poison would be given to him though he didn't know what the orders and the mission given to the wife by the president could be therefore he, he left home but he kept on sending the home necessities to take care of his two children Bagiro father closed that three weeks back the mother of his children bought a house in Bunga worth 600 million Ugandan shillings where she is currently living with their kids and new husband Hamza. She brought her sister and other unidentified woman plus a military officer to stay in their marital house because for her she went to another marriage. And now Bigira is saying that he wants back his house because his partner moved on and he has been quiet since last year reason being that he was destabilized disorganized and psychologically tortured but as the people power general there is that word there goes that continued with the struggle the struggle continues so that's what kept him living because of the people power slang Bigira also warned president Museven that he cheated his parliamentary elections connived with his state house operative to take away his wife but one thing he will not accept is for him to take his small house. If he is to die, he is ready to die, as Vigira exclaimed. Meanwhile, the property row case between Vigira and his battled wife is already in the hands of the police. We are waiting for what will be next, whether he will get back his home custody. That's what we don't know. Well, that is it for now. Thanks for watching Progen Media TV. But we'll keep on updating with more of this. Kindly do one thing. Subscribe and turn the notification button. All these updates will come to you in time. Once again, thanks for watching.